Hello and welcome to Investigative Math. Today, we'll be learning how to use the bump -a trick. The bump -a trick can be used any time you're multiplying two two-digit numbers, such that the ones digits add to 10 and the tens digits are the same. So let's get to it. For our first example, we have 34 times 36. We know the bump -a trick can be used because four plus six is 10 and three is equal to three. The first step is to multiply the ones digits. Four times six is 24, and so we write the 24. The next step is where the bump it trick gets its name. You want to take one of the tens digits, I'm going to take this 3 over here, for example, cross it out and make it one more than itself. So now it's a 4. Now multiply the tens digits, 4 times 3 is 12, and so 34 times 36 is 1224. To recap, first multiply the ones digits, 4 times 6 is 24, and make sure that this takes up two decimal places. For example, let's say we had 31 times 39. The first step would be to multiply the ones digits. One times nine is nine, but you have to make sure that it takes up two decimal places. So you would write zero nine instead of just nine. The next step is to bump up one of your tens digits by one. In this case, I picked this three on the left, bumped it up by one to make it a four, and then multiplied it by the other tens digit. 4 times 3 is 12, and so we have 1224. For our next example, we have 71 times 79. We know this will work because our 1's digits will add to 10, 1 plus 9 is equal to 10, and our 10's digits are the same, as they are both 7. The first step is to multiply the 1's digits. 1 times 9 is 9, but since this has to take up two decimal places, you write 0, 9. The next step, bump up one of the 10's digits. So I'm going to make this 7 and 8, and then do 8 times your other tens digit, or 7. 8 times 7 is 56, so 71 times 79 is 5609. Now that you have an idea of how to do this kind of question, I've provided a problem set in the description of this video for you to try a couple for yourself. If you need me to clarify anything for you, leave a comment and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you enjoyed this video and found it informative, leave a like, and if you really loved it, make sure to subscribe. I'll see you later.